UK startup Satellite View is using infrared imaging to police carbon emissions. If the world is going to reduce the amount of coal we use in our power stations, who is going to monitor and make sure that power stations are not using that? The company plans to launch a constellation of seven thermal and infrared imaging satellites into space to provide real-time data on how much greenhouse gas a building, company or even a country is emitting. Alex Gao is the sales director at Satellite View. It's going to be a constellation of seven satellites. And those seven satellites, which are going to be in slightly different orbits, are going to give us the ability to capture images up to 20 times per day or night. So, so close to hourly, essentially, for, for collecting images over point targets. So the types of change we'll see from that are going to be quite drastic. Um, being able to uh, detect objects and, and measure change of facilities through that time and, and, sh and show that picture. Our unique sensor can measure subtle changes of temperature on the Earth's surface. The company says their technology is capable of identifying illegal discharges into the sea or rivers and can see who's still burning coal. That, they say, will help police the climate promises made at the COP26 climate summit in Glasgow. We will be able to measure the thermal output from that and report on it on a global scale so no one can hide from uh, the ability to be able to use fossil fuels and, and, and burn carbon in that kind of environment. The technology can even spot the specific thermal signature of large concentrations of plastic pollution. Satellite View says their data can also flag up when not enough energy is being used. There are key applications, that, including fuel poverty. So if a household is, is not using heat, uh, they're not using energy and they can't afford that, they will show up as a, a cooler building potentially within our, our images. So that's a, an application of being able to find and help people that are potentially in need. Um, but activity monitoring of, of houses and the occupancy of those houses and characterising how a building or a property is being used has numerous applications across industry, uh, insurance, uh, as well as government applications as well. The first satellite will launch at the end of 2022 with the other six following between 2023 and 2026.